Hi everyone. Okay, I just I want to share with you guys how I do my daily for monthly for March. Okay, uh what I use. Actually, I already made a video, but I accidentally deleted it. Anyway, so what you have now is what it has been done throughout the video. How so I just want to share with you guys what I used and just to make the dailies okay i use some stickers i'm going to i'm going to show you guys which one first of all i print uh, print out these um any plans printable inserts it's the lux um minimalist with all the black and white so you can print it black and white and then i they have a few um several type of inserts they have monthly have she also have the weekly and dailies so i printed the monthly with dates that i already uh, i already dated it i used the a very light color which is gray color and this is pink because birthdays and um bigger font just to make a little different of what my monthly looks like and also i labeled it as march 2020 and then this one i write my using this pen which is the pilot g207 so this is the daily i use the date dot, dots and also day covers for the whole month so um until sunday on the 29th because 30th and 31st will be in the april insects april daily so okay so that's the front and back okay what tools i use is this apesco punch puncher um okay it's make sure you uh set it right on the which uh, the sizes before punch because i always make that silly mistake before checking up the uh setting and just punch away and then i also use this corner rounder that i bought ages ago and i don't really remember from where i think it's one of the local shop and it really works for me i love how it rounded like so i always uh round okay i'll show you how i round mine i always round my inserts this way because i want it to be like open book so i rounded only on the outer corner in the inside i just leave it uh square so it looks like a very nice open book right so yep that's how I do it and this is the leftovers after punch cut and everything you will have this large uh, leftovers and it's not really I can't really use it because of the inserts is different so I just throw that away and then I have um, the stickers yes stickers that I use this is a sticker book from Muji and I print out the um happy scrappy digitals on a sticker paper and then i just stick it to this measure and stick it to this um sticker book stick album yeah i just this is muji it's very sturdy i love the paper as well it's very good quality better than daiso definitely but the price is almost the same i think difference like one ringgit so I use this um this one for my uh date dots and also date cover. Um this is the um uh this is the travel uh travel ha happy scrappy kit. So yes, I use that. And then um that's for stickers. And also I want to share with you guys this um, this is an undo that you use uh, for us. I just 
this is as as good as undo this is the liquid label make rem liquid label remover i got it from daiso i'm not sure whether they got daiso name no it's all in japanese so what i did was i okay let me just show you one so that you can you guys can see how it works so i take one of these and then maybe um, one of the stickers i want it something that i don't want to use. okay i use one of these maybe just a few of it okay and then what i did is take out the um just dip into it into the liquid like so and then what i usually did before you do anything just close it just in case you accidentally knock it out okay so i just put at the back first it won't smear your ink whatever ink or the, um, even it's a death jet or the, of course if it's um uh what you call it laser it won't smear but smudge but same goes any type of tinting it will not smudge so like so and then you use these um tools just um do like this and then it's take out it's it's removed all you need to do is just let it uh dry okay let it dry first don't let it dry and then same thing it's easy to remove actually it will not um, damage the stickers as well as the papers so yeah so maybe you can just do it that way and then once it's dry you still can use it as a sticker so that's what I did for my sticker that I have used accidentally place it in the different in a not supposed in a you know diff, in the wrong place yep yeah so that is how it works it's really really cool stuff for finding it 90 cent it's really really cool stuff um so that's that um just that way yeah i think that's all i want that's all Oh yeah, I want to show you guys how I use my daily. Usually what I did when I'm planning, let me just put that, okay. Um, on the monthly basis, usually I don't change anything in here. I If I got time, then only I'll change it. But most of the time, I don't. So what I did was I just changed the dailies, which is this part only this part is changing every month monthly because i plan in it maybe just um just yeah i plan i love to plan in my a6 so that's why i you know, i only change the daily inside here in, only daily will be changing every month and the rest i just fill in whatever information that i need to fill for record and everything but this is the only insert that i'm going to uh, frequently change on the monthly basis uh and also if you guys notice this the gap here okay because every time i cut my paper i always uh, after i punch it i always uh cut it a little bit here so that it won't it will have this kind of gap so when you turn the page it won't um it won't you know it won't be stuck if you can see i don't except for this one of course i don't cut this this is from caspresso go uh every time i have my planet is really really full but still i can turn it so easily 
see it's so easy to turn so like i said just now my planner is really really full it's full it's, it's really full so yeah i always cut that part and also i don't really have month uh, weekly inside my daily because i have this i have weekly but it's just for um meal planning i have this weekly here in my um pocket rings this is my kids and husband's office details for weekdays and then i have this um weekly which i write my stuff every day what i'm going to do that day and all so this is this week so yeah basically this planner works um as a edc and also my planning as well i need it to be with me so i know what what's going on on that day so i think that's all i want to share i'm so so tired because i did a video and i deleted the video and it's really really sad Maybe I'll be careful next time. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. If you got any question, just let me know. And this, I have another video of this pouch. This is Delphonic pouch in S size. Okay, I'll show you guys later on. Have a pleasant day. Bye.